slept with my best friend's girlfriend on a GCSE college trip. No one knows. I haven't changed my sheets in two months. I secretly pick my nose and wipe the bogeys on my wall and bed. I had sex in college. There are people in my close family I feel no emotional attachment towards. I hate tutorial and I also really don't care about student attendance statistics at all. I found a purse on the train, unaware of the owner at first. I automatically checked through it. We found £60 inside. The first thought was to take the cash and chuck the purse. We then found the owner was the woman two seats ahead. We took the cash and left the purse on the train. I split it with a friend because obviously I am caring. I love eating French bread steak dunked in yoghurt. This is not my hat. I stole it. Somewhere in the world there are a few tapes of me snorting lines of speed in my bedroom. I don't know where they are. For all I know, you might have seen them yourself. Once my friend pooed himself in our local graveyard, and we never told the local authorities to spare him the embarrassment. I just discovered my little brother's cheating test in school. He's nine in year four. He's smart and popular, and I'm so shocked. I don't know what to do. My parents are strict. Do I just keep it to myself? I keyed someone's car. Sorry. Life is hard and no one realises that enough. My confession is, I've given up. I make petty judgments about your character based on your choice of sofa. I lie about having seen films and TV shows just so that I don't have to listen to people tell me about them. I hang the clothes I like best with my favourite hangers but I feel bad for the shirts that I give the bad hangers to. I always copy and paste. I overfeed the cat. I put fake events on my Google Calendar just so I feel a little bit more important. I kissed my sister in a hot tub. I'm gay. I hate going to my mental illness support group. When I walk in the room, I just see a bunch of images of what it must look like to regular, non-mentally ill people. This makes me cruel, probably, or even mean, but it's true. Sometimes I'm terrified I'm going to end up like my parents. I feel most alive when everything around me is dying. My sister and I have pretend fights in public just to see people's reactions. Sometimes we just cuss at each other, other times it turns to a full-blown girl fight. I wish you would stop being so concerned about my weight and be more concerned about my lack of happiness. Is it so bad that I have nothing to confess, that I'm not ashamed of anything? <laughs>